Morning everyone. Today's going to be an absolute beautiful day. It's supposed to be up around 70 degrees, uh, light winds, and the sun's supposed to be shining all day. We have about a dozen yards to do, and they're all pretty easy yards, so uh, let's get started. This yard you've seen before, it's been a while since I've been on this yard, but um, that's all water still. And it is down lower than it was originally, but you could see where all the water was laying. So this yard is going to be fun because that's all water laying over there, and that's always going to be there because that's at the same level as the lake. And there's the lake coming up here. There's all water here is going squish. So we are going to be leaving tire tracks everywhere. tire tracks here. I think you didn't have too bad of a spot out there, but uh, the boardwalk's uh, been floating a couple times. And a few tracks here, but not too bad.
Lake Huron shoreline here is uh, all pretty damp and wet. So it's uh, you can tell it's been raining for days. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm not sure uh, how much more these yards you can be able to take because last year was a drought for six weeks and these yards got all burned up and now they're being flooded. So uh, I don't know. Some of these yards are not fair to well right now. A couple of them, uh, we're probably only going to cut about three or four times this whole season and then we'll be done with them. So, nothing we can do about it, it's just uh, we got to play the weather game. Last year we played the drought game, this, one, this summer we're playing the what? The water. Yeah, the rain game. Yeah, the rain game. Rain games and <laughs> drought. So, uh, I think they'd rather have the rain though than the drought. Yeah, that, at least that part. But sure would be nice if it would actually stay in s above 70 degrees for more than uh, one day out of the month. But Although it is kind of nice, it's not like scorching hot out, because it could be scorching hot and dry. Yeah, it could be that, because that yeah, that's that usually what happens about this time of the month. This time of month, this time of the summer. So usually about June, we're picking the decks up. Usually the first week, and uh, we just started picking the decks up right now. So I think we started picking them up last week, and that's about it. So anyhow, we're going to continue on. So we've been, or Vicky's been cutting uh, with that skag all morning, and by lowering them baffles yesterday, there's not as much grass coming up on the deck, which uh, makes it uh, look a lot cleaner, and it's not getting all plugged up with everything. So. Um, that part is done good, and that's where I think I'm just going to leave it like that because so far it's, I'm happy with it. And then uh, we'll, I'm still thinking about the deck height and how I'm going to adjust that. I've got a couple ideas, and uh, just got to think on it a little bit longer, or a little bit longer, and then uh, probably next, or by the weekend, I'll probably uh, make some more adjustments on it to get the deck where it's supposed to be instead of being an inch off on the measurements. It just gets a little confusing. So spread the clippings out a little more too, maybe? Uh, no, the depth heights will be about the same, but the clippings are spreading out farther. Vicki hasn't gone uh, double cut anything yet, have you, today? No, so I think I did yesterday so far is working out. So we just finished our last lawn for the day. We had absolutely no problems today, and I think that skag uh, worked a little better for dispersing the clippings, but we won't know in, for a couple more days when we get into a yard that's got a whole lot of grass. So that's going to be the end of our video for today. I thank you for watching and subscribing. If you check out the links in the description box, it will be greatly appreciated. Have a good evening. See you at the next yard. Goodbye.